Hi everybody, my name is Steve. I currently work for Ecotone Incorporated, and we are currently at Upper Little Patuxent Stream Restoration Project. This project is about 4,000 linear feet of stream restoration, and the main goal of this project is to help prevent nitrous, phosphate, and erosion and other sediments that are coming and getting carried down the stream and taken to the Chesapeake Bay. I'm currently in one of our floodplains. This area here, we pulled a lot of the dirt out to give the stream area to grow and expand at times where we have a lot of water flow. Again, like I said, the state is very excited about these projects. All this work that we're doing now will make our bay be nice and clean, so you guys have a lot of good crab noise for deep this summer. It's hard to see, it's a little cloudy, but underneath the water here, we've got a bunch of rocks that are about the size of salt pools. We've got them all piled up, and underneath that, we actually utilize natural materials such as sticks and grains and things like that that we put underneath. And what that does is as the water's flowing over, it's going to keep everything compact and keep the sediment from flowing downstream. Another form of sediment control we have are these coir matting right here on the ground. As you can see, any area that we've disturbed with machinery or shovels or anything like that, we come in and staple this material to the ground so that it won't move, keeping all of our ground and our soil sediment material all in place. As we continue to move upstream here at Upper Little Patuxent, you can see we're still working a little ways in there. there in the distance. We have our excavators and dump trucks going. But right here we are at one of the bends in the stream. What we do at one of our bends, we dig out this area. It's a, one of our pools. It's about four feet deep. It allows for the water as it's coming in and making its turn to kind of slow down so it stops eroding this part of the bank here. Also, as a, another way to keep the sediment from running downstream, we put a bunch of these root watts here. The Ruwats have a double purpose. As I said, they hold the sediment and ground in place, but they also provide a great habitat for fish, frogs, any kind of animals that'll be out here swimming around. So a nice double purpose while keeping the water flowing downstream. All right, here we are all the way at the top upstream of Upper Little Patuxent, all right? I want to show you kind of the area that we're about to get to and some of the things that we're trying to correct as we move upstream. As you can see here, this far bank, about five feet high, it's just getting cut away by the rivers it comes through. As we come in, we're gonna come in, take some of this material out and create a nice big floodplain. That way as this stream fills up, it'll have somewhere for the water to go instead of just keep cutting away at the bank as it continues to go downstream. We're also gonna completely move the channel over a little bit to take this bend out and not make it so drastic. 